Hello guys, how you doing? So, I'm finally going to watch um, the volume 9 of uh, Ruby today and uh, I'm really excited to see um, what's going to happen during um, this one considering uh, everything that happened uh, during uh, the volume 8 so it was uh, really wild, there was um, a lot um, going on um, and um, of course um, I also watched it um, some time ago, so I'm probably not going to remember every single detail, but uh, I have like um, like an idea of uh, uh, all of the big things that happened at least. Um, and um, I'm really curious to find out about um, what is going to happen now. Like they were uh, in this um, like specific place created by um, um, Ambrosius uh, and... Um, the last thing that they showed was uh, Ruby's uh, uh, weapon uh, at some uh, like different place. So it's uh, something that I'm not too sure about, like where exactly um, uh, that is. Like it's something that they are probably going to reveal um, during um, this volume. Uh, but uh, it really feels like um, some of these uh, girls uh, are going to like be split in different uh, places. There was also that um, one moment that worried me um, a lot with uh, uh, Yang uh, uh, falling. Like I I'm really not too sure uh, like what um, is going to happen to her. Hopefully she is still um, alive. Um, and uh, also one of the one of the worst things that happened in a way, like, um, I don't know how exactly to put it, it's uh, one of the things that uh, made me really sad. So, at the start of the volume, we saw um, uh, Penny once again, it was like something that made me so happy, like seeing uh, her um, back uh, and doing well. Uh, but then, by the end of the volume, she ended up uh, like dying. So, again, it's... It's, it's really hard to even put um, like these uh, feelings uh, into words because it, it just really crushed my heart to see them bringing her back only to um, have her die again. But yeah, there was uh, like even with that, there was like some really great moments with Penny. Like it's impossible to forget about um, everything that she did. And uh, it's crazy what... Um, John uh, had to uh, had to do as well, like how uh, Penny asked him to kill her so she could pass uh, her power, the the Winter Maiden's power, uh, to Winter. So that was like a really big decision. It, it it was like it was again just a really intense season. They had to make some really hard uh, uh, choices uh, during it. There was like a lot of tension um, between um, a lot of these. Um, a lot of these people, but yeah, in the end, I'm just like really curious to see uh, what is going to happen now. We saw Cinder also getting possession of um, both relics, and now uh, she's like gone with um, Salem. And uh, I'm uh, also positive that uh, Ironwood uh, uh, died, right? I'm not too sure, but um, I think he was like inside of that. Um, of that uh, big uh, ship and uh, like it was falling. It's something that I'm not too sure about. Uh, like I don't know if it was confirmed that uh, he died or not. Um, but yeah, either way, like I said before, I just uh, really can't wait to um, to watch uh, this uh, first episode to find out more about um, everything that um, is going on. So hope you guys are ready and let's start it. I'm probably going to get more um, used to it again while watching this first episode. This is the story of a girl who had a lot of problems. I wonder who she's talking about. Could be a lot of them. This is Ruby's point of view. You should have never been born. This when you also <sighs> I 
Yeah, it's like Team Ruby. They were all falling. Oh. There's, there's just like so many things going through my mind right now. This is the place they ended up at. Yeah, it's like they're going to be in a, a totally different place. Like they didn't go through one of those portals. So that's what I'm wondering about. Which kind of place this is. There's a tree they showed. I think there was a lot of theories being made about that tree. Like it's the tree that connects a lot of worlds and stuff. It's like a thing from other stories. Like the, the world tree, I believe that's the name. Which would make sense in this case. Oh. It's a funny bird. It's just really... Makes me so happy to see Ruby again though. I'm excited to see the others. Hopefully they're doing fine. It's been a while since I watched the previous volume. And this was also delayed, so... This volume. But now it's finally here. And I already have some... Quite a lot of episodes to watch. a really cute mouse. What is that? Is that cheese? I was like wondering, but it really looks like cheese. Now if only you could help me. I could try. It talks. Wait, what the? <laughs> why are you yelling? <laughs> yeah, I wonder why. Because you, uh, <laughs> you, uh, did you want to share? Oh, I guess it's only fair. No, that, uh, that's <laughs> all right. Uh, I guess uh, I've just never really spoken to a, a mouse before. Hmm. I guess things are going to be well, quite different here. I guess I've never spoken to a you before. <laughs> what are you? Oh, uh, I'm a human. A girl. A huntress. That's a lot of things. Ooh. I'm... Ruby. I'm Ruby Rose. <laughs> and to Ruby Rose is your purpose? No, no, that's, that's my name. Do you have a name? I'm still young, so not yet. Hmm. How about I call you Will for now? Would that be Will? Right? Hmm. How does one little? <laughs> oh, I guess it's fitting. Huh? What's wrong? I'm. Uh, have you seen 
other people? Humans. Like me. Exactly like you? No, not exactly like me. I mean, we're similar, but different. I'm sure it'll make sense eventually. Um... I mean, this is probably totally new. have long blonde hair. For them to... The other has... Well, uh, uh, cat ears. Oh. <laughs> All right, cats and mouses. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, that was funny. I've never seen anyone who does or doesn't look like you. But maybe someone in my village has. They're always out foraging. You know, Ooh. since we need food. A village. Speaking of which... Few more of these wouldn't hurt. Oh, <laughs> it's like around here somewhere. Help me with that, and I'll say I'm certain help you. Anything at the moment. Gamble Shroud fell out. Oh, there's Weiss and Blade. But before I did, but yeah, each other, so it would be terrifying for those mouses to see Blake. <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> although she wouldn't be at rest. My guess is, but they don't know that. Sense. Blake. I'm really glad you're okay. Me too. I'm really glad you are too. Especially since she's my favorite. If we are, then that means Yang and Ruby might be. I'm worried about Yang. Weiss, can you... What happened after we fell? In the appeared here. We should focus on finding everyone else first. I think I see something. Gonna have to discover more about this, just like us. That's her weapon. Guess it could have been worse. <laughs> well, good news. I'm low on dust. That wasn't an invitation, Weiss. Sorry. <laughs> oh, it just grows more. Man, that's going to be... <laughs> oh my god. Wait, that's... A lot of it. And that's a whole lot of mouses. That was their trap? <laughs> I guess Ruby is going in their direction. Oh my god. What are they even planning to do on doing with them? Telling the whole story. <laughs> you have our sincerest apologies. Please understand that our kind is a bit well, at skeptical. least it didn't take long. And snakes. Like this misunderstanding. And cats. We understand. Hmm. If we could ask. Have you seen anyone else who looks like us? Long blonde hair. Looks kind of scary, but isn't. But <laughs> she wanted to. Yep. The eyes, though. I like when that happens. Different eyes. I don't know, I just find it really cool. Before all of this, I was trying to go to that cliff over there. I figured going to higher ground and getting my bearings would be good. Sounds like the best option for now. If you yeah, like go to the cliff, I could help with that. Oh, I <laughs> don't really have anything to do yet. Surprising to see I them so close to Blake already. Says that and then goes to sleep. <laughs> or, I guess we can figure it out ourselves. At least I guess. Path. We need to hurry. Yang's been down here the longest, and we still haven't found her. Yeah. Weiss, I was. I'm getting like less worried. Like she should be here somewhere. 
Are there? But I'm worried about uh, her condition. What happened? Especially since I don't know if anyone else she's alone. Knows. No, I think we should find Yang, if she's even down here. Then what about Neo over. as well? I just she was falling too, right? Can't really remember what happened after. Is that a Grim? What is that? Is it like transforming? That looks really creepy. We actually forgot the weapon. Oh, damn. I said I wasn't done with you yet. Oh, that's Yang. She's been fighting against it. Oh, her arm as well. What is it saying? It's like some random words. It almost as if saying what is thinking or something. We weren't supposed to be here. I mean, if you thought we wouldn't come for you, none of them must have forgotten who raised were supposed you. to be here. What happened to your arm? I don't think you'd believe me if I told you. Why not? You seem trustworthy. Uh, Ruby. Yeah, what happened? What is that? Oh. oh. Man, that's so sweet. I sort of Blake was so worried, of course. Yes, I am. It's just, it must have gone pretty bad, huh? Hmm. Lice. I, everything happened so fast. No one came back from Vacuo to help. And Penny, she. Sean tried to help, but she sacrificed herself. <laughs> oh, damn. And I mean, it's exactly as I said. Everything happened so fast. And now it's like... Things are finally eating, right? Maybe everyone else made it. I don't know, but I have a bad feeling. Neo's here too. Hey. Neo. Right? She attacked me when we were falling. I wonder what she's up to. Okay. Like I saw them together, but then Neo stopped. Ruby's weapon is still missing. And Man's Ruby was stolen. continued falling. I think we focus on getting everything back. Then we can figure out exactly how to get out of here. Wherever here is. Ooh. But what if we can't leave? Or what if what if we're dead? I mean Until you all found me, I thought Yeah, we hopefully dead. it won't be like that. No. I don't think we're dead. I know how this sounds, but I think we're in a fairy tale. A fairy tale. I really wonder what exactly this place is supposed to be. Oh, that's the opening, right? Always something I'm excited to see. Ooh. Man, I love the start. Hey, this is really cool. Like showing the previews, how they were at first, the transitions. Who's that? Oh, John.
Man, I'm loving these vibes. Who's that as well? Look like a green, but... Doesn't really feel like it's one. Wait, this is supposed to be Neo. Not too sure, the way they did it. Is there more or... Oh, it's like... Okay, so now it's... The ending. But it really makes me wonder... What is this place? What are they supposed to do here? It's like... None of them were supposed... Man, I'm really loving these screens, by the way. <laughs> they look really cool. But yeah, they, were, they weren't supposed to fall to that place. Like, th they were supposed to go through those portals to evacuate... All of the people. But now this happened. And now they find themselves here. And just like them, like I have no idea what they're supposed to to do here. And like how can they even escape from this place and return to to their world? It's like there's a lot of um Lots of things that I'm just like thinking about. It's this story started becoming quite complex. Like at first, um, I'm not too sure how to put this, but um, during the first seasons, everything was quite straightforward, and they were like uh, their goal was always um, the same. But then um, everything started changing, and there was uh, like like the more they started showing especially the story about salem and uh, everything uh, like the grand scheme of things it started becoming um, a lot more complex and and now there's um, a lot uh, of uh, things uh, to think about and to be worried about as well so again it's uh, definitely making um, all of it um, more and more interesting that's for sure um, but uh, I'm here, like, uh, a bit uh, at a loss, like, uh, wondering about uh, what exactly is going on. So, definitely going to be interesting to see how everything will develop and uh, what uh, these girls are going to have to do uh, in this specific uh, world. Uh, uh, like Blake said, this looks a bit like uh, a fairy tale, so, again, just makes me wonder what uh, is going to happen. Um, but yeah, in the end I'm uh, just really glad to see um, all of them uh, doing well. I was like really worried uh, at the end of uh, the previous volume, seeing them falling and stuff and not too sure about um, where uh, or like what was going uh, to happen um, uh, to them. Um, but yeah, also not really sure how they're going to do things because right now... Team Ruby is down here, and like they said, Neo is um, is also here. Um, but um, there's also a lot going on in their world. So I don't know if they're going to spend uh, some uh, time showing what is happening in um, in that place as well or not, or if they're going to mostly focus um, on this place with Team Ruby during this volume. It's something that I'm going to have to discover um, during these next episodes, of course. Um, but yeah, just uh, really looking forward to see what is going to happen and uh, like to discover what uh, this place uh, this place is supposed um, uh, to be and sp specifically this um, this guy who just showed up who looked like a grim like uh, i'm really curious um, about him um but yeah there's also this sort of uh, a mouse tribe or so to say and they can talk so that's uh, uh, also something uh, and it created a lot of uh, fun moments, so I'm uh, definitely excited to see more um, of them because they seem to be really kind and um, I'm uh, expecting them to be sort of uh, relevant during um, some of these um, upcoming uh, situations. At least uh, I don't think that they will be like an enemy or anything like that. I think that uh, they are going to be um, quite helpful during this um, sort of an adventure uh, for Team Ruby right now. Um, but yeah, either way, really loved uh, watching uh, this first episode and uh, the opening was also really, really good. I love uh, uh, the vibe of it. It was really awesome. And yeah, just really can't wait to see what's going to happen during uh, the next uh, episode.
So with this, hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.